For how long do you supplement B complex when there's elevated homocysteine unknown MTHFR status? For the most part, when I'm recommending a B complex, it's usually something that I'm recommending patients taking on an ongoing basis. I am checking their B12 and folic acid on follow-up labs, obviously having them skip the supplement for a few days before and checking their homocysteine. And sometimes what I might do, especially if everything looks really normal, is I might have them decrease the B complex from daily to say three times a week. But for the most part, if someone comes to you and they're deficient in B vitamins, it's because of MTHFR status or diet that's going to stay the same or some other factor that's going to be a chronic factor. And they would usually warrant ongoing supplementation with a B vitamin. So I just might decrease the frequency if it seems like the patient doesn't need it so much. You know, symptomatically, they're normal. Even after skipping the B for several days before the lab test, it's well over 400. In that case, I might decrease the frequency of it.